So in this video here, we're going to do a comparison of the new MacBook Pro M2 chip. So we're basically going to take a look at the 14 inch MacBook Pro and also the 16 inch. We're going to do a comparison and I'm going to tell you which of those models you should choose. This is going to be a short comparison because I think that you should just go buy the MacBook M2 Pro with the 16 inch display. And the reason for that is that we want as much screen estate as possible. So I've seen some reviews out there comparing the 14 inch with the 16 inch MacBook Pro. And they're talking about the 16 inch being too big to move around. Uh, sit with it on your lap and all those different things and that is not the experience that I've had I can actually like sit around where I want to I can sit at like outside tables I can sit in my chair I can have the computer on my lap and it's actually like, easier to have such a large laptop on my lap because it just has like more uh, balance to it so I actually like, like the 16 inch and I will definitely recommend you go with the 16 inch unless you really want the 14 inch so if you're not sure which one to buy i will definitely just recommend go with the 16 inch i i love the screen estate we get we get 16 inches uh, we can see way more going on it is better for editing it is better for programming doing documents and all those different kind of things also just browsing the internet and i've not experienced like any problems with having it on my lap moving around go out grab a coffee while coding and all those different kind of things like they can fit on different tables okay it might not fit uh, in like an airplane or it even might be a bit more difficult on, on an airplane but again how many how many times and how many hours are actually like using your macbook on an airplane compared to sitting at your table at home uh going outside sitting on on the couch and all those different kind of things so again Go with the 16 inch, no doubt. So if you're 100% sure that you want the 14 model, definitely go with that. Again, all these things are personal preferences. I just think that the 16 inch will get way more out of the 16 inch compared to the 14 inch. Again, if you need a MacBook that you need to move around a lot, you need to sit with it on, in airplanes and all those different kind of things, I will definitely just recommend go with the MacBook Air M2 chip. And then if you're doing more heavy work, you will have a MacBook Pro 16 inch. You can connect it to the multiple monitors and then you can even use your MacBook together with your external monitors. And you can even use the screen on your 16 inch MacBook Pro um, as, a, as a monitor as well together with your additional um, external monitors so i'm almost 100 sure that you won't regret buying the 16 inch macbook pro i'm not going to regret it and if i need a smaller device i have my ipad pro or then i will just go for the macbook air m2 if you're just going to do a lot of work like moving around you don't need like the processing power when you want the power from the macbook m2 pro chip uh, then you're actually like doing more advanced stuff you're doing some more heavy tasks um, editing 3d stuff and all those different kind of things and then you will also benefit from the larger display on the 16 inch model so i hope this has cleared your thoughts about what model to buy go with the 16 inch you will not regret it so thank you guys for watching this video here and again remember to hit the subscribe button and bell notification on the video also like this video if you like the content and you want more in the future it just really helps me and the youtube channel out in a massive way so i hope you will enjoy your new macbook pro and that you won't regret buying the 16 inch over the 14 inch and then I'll just see you next week, guys. Bye for now.